Hi. You ask what's unusual about this book. What will you find in this book that you won't find anywhere else? Well, one of the key things in this book that separates it from all others is how you, the entrepreneur, are sometimes your own biggest enemy. Let me give you an example. There's something called the founder's dilemma, and that's the fact that what makes for a great person to start a business makes for sometimes the worst enemy to a business's growth and success. You see, when you start a business, it's you against the world. You're working late, you're checking every good or service that you sell, you're making sure it's perfect, and people don't get it, but you get it, and so you're there, and you're, you're checking every little widget to make sure it's perfect. Well, later on, when you've grown, when you've got that tremendous demand for your product, it's very hard to let go. It's very hard to delegate. Are these other people going to get it? And the first time they don't get it, it reinforces your idea that they don't get it. So where do you end up? You end up, you're behind the big desk, and there's 20 people lined up outside your office door waiting for you to approve the weight of the paper for your new stationery. Well, you can't grow a business when you're micromanaging every aspect of your business, but it's micromanagers that found and succeed with small businesses. That's why they call it the founder's dilemma. What do you do? Well, it's all here in the book, but let me give you a quick preview. You need to change your personality from Michael Jordan scoring every basket to Phil Jackson, who takes a lot of great pride in coaching a good team. Sure, that sounds easy. Turn from Michael Jordan to Phil Jackson. Well, how do I do that? Let me give you one example of how you do that and, and why most people don't succeed at that transition. The, one of the most important things that you can do to change from superstar to super coach is hire good people. Surround yourself with tremendous talent because if you hire, if you hire weak players, they're going to fail or they won't meet your expectations and it'll reinforce your view that only you can succeed with this business. But if you go ahead and you get superstars, sure, it's gonna be threatening. They're gonna be scoring baskets and they're gonna be getting the roar of the crowd, not you. And we're gonna have to talk more about that and you're gonna get more information from that in the book, but it will enable you to have the confidence that you can start to let go and let other people carry the company to the next level with you as a mentor, as a coach, as a tutor. Thank you. I'm Jack Garson.